Hey guys, they're orange. So we're back with some more Until Dawn. So let's do this. We're playing as Sam now. And we stopped right where we were. Move the camera with our right. Okay. Let's look around. What? <sighs> Damn it. Okay. Mm. Oh, Jesus, never mind. Um, well, we gotta climb over, so let's see. Maybe right here. This looks like climbable stuff. Quick. Let's go with quick. I like quick. She's gonna hurt herself. Climb, climb. Alright, well, that's creepy, whatever that guy is over there doing. Oh, Hey, little fella. You hungry? Huh? <laughs> Cutie. Hmm. Okay. Give us those current objectives. Okay. Another totem or something? No, just a piece of rock. Never mind. Looks like another totem right there. <laughs> cool. Butterfly prophecies. Death, black butterfly prophesies of dreamer's death, danger, red. Of warning, okay. Luck and good fortune. I'm gonna take a picture of this with my phone. I'm being like that serious. It might come in handy in a little bit. I think there's a totem on the ground near us. Alright. Yeah, do it. It's yellow. All right. Oops, yeah, press the wrong button. So yellow, as the thing said, offered visions to help guide you. Okay. Wow, graffiti all the way up here. I just want to see if there's anything else here. I don't really like the idea of that dude being there watching us. Chris? Are you here? Bag's here. Where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Hello. What do we have here? I'll snoop. <laughs> Has a crush on Ashley. Okay, protective, humorous. You scared me. Uh, 
I'm sorry, are, are you my secretary? I was buzzing. Cool, well, thanks for letting me know. I, I can take it from here. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. Ta-da! Pretty rad, right? Look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. <laughs> All right, here goes. Well, let me shoot. I see. You have to shoot the stuff that they want you to shoot. Wow, nice shooting tits. All right. I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna mm -hmm. go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Nah, no, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. No. I'll shoot the squirrel. Shot. Your ass just got sacked. <sighs> hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. I guess it wouldn't matter if I shot the squirrel. Oh, now I get to play as him. Interesting. Anything over here? I guess not. I'm coming, I'm coming. Man, it is. It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. Yeah, I swear it is. Found a clue. They're rolling the mystery man. For the moment I got here, it just all came flooding back. Here goes fast. Oh man, look at this. Nice. You think we'll get a visit from America's Most Wanted? Looks like someone thought so. Oh, come on. This place is abandoned mostly. Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm starting to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? It's a big mountain. Oh, whoops, sorry. Not, not used to the controls what yet. What a crazy place to set up how. Dang it, I keep, keep pressing the wrong button. I mean, no matter how rich you are. They're not so rich. They only bought a mountain.
That was weird. Kind of sketchy, if you ask me. I'll see if there's anything else in here. Hmm. All right. Guess we'll keep going. Finally, you coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some Z's, but okay. I'm just like going to the prom. Begins. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, and I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So, I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. <laughs> Sketchy. Mike's new girlfriend. Okay. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. <gasps> what the hell? Jess, hey! Jessica, over here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? I thought we were goners. Another 10 minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey, Chris. <laughs> I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal playground. Do not be a jerk. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Oh. All right, all right, let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just 
stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? I don't think it would have been like as pretty. You know? And where's the bellboy when you need one? Is that a totem? I keep thinking there there's totems here and every time it's just nothing. Alright, let's go. Getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, uh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. I mean, what do you think? Ah! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right Dude, there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being, you always get like this. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out, otherwise this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't wanna make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, no, seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back on the trip. All right, okay. See you, man. See ya. All right, see ya. Oh, crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, just all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Em, I really don't think you should head back down the trail by yourself. Seriously? It's cold out and it's getting dark. You're gonna protect me from it being dark out? I'll just leave your stuff here and come with you. Nobody's gonna steal it. Matt, are you kidding me? You can't leave me alone for five minutes? You really think that little of me? That's not what I meant. Why can't you just listen to me? Why do you have to question everything I say? I'm sorry, Em. I'm just trying to be helpful. If you wanna be helpful, then you can help get everything up to the lodge as quickly as you can, okay? Um. Uh, okay. Fine. Whatever you want. Thank you. I'll see you up there after I go find Sam. See you in a bit. I don't trust her. She seems kind of off to me. Oh. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not in the friend zone kind of way. Yep, I knew we it. We need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. I knew it. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> hey, whoa. <sighs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hey, wow. Well, man, I'm not really sorry, Ash. Damn. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it... Let me check it out. Uh, damn. Uh, I want to. I want to see it. 
Um, sure, uh, go, go ahead. Knock yourself out, I guess. Oh. Son of a bitch! Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. The nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I... God damn it. Matt. Not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. The hell am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> Oh, great. <laughs> hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chickadee? Oh, ah! Hi. Hey! Oh, snap! You can't hide from me, Michael. I know all your tricks. Whoa! Ow. And then what? Oh, no more. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> gotcha. Done. Done city. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right. All right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor, then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. I don't think I picked one. They kind of just chose for me. Wow. Save some for later, buddy. Endless reserves. <gasps> we should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. session you were not completely honest with me i'm an expert with years of experience you don't think you can mislead me this time we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety now pick up that book turn the pages you will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious.
Hmm. I don't really fear either. So I'll go with drowning. I definitely like snakes over rats. Hmm. Oh. The fuck? Did I startle you? Is that so right? Right? You're doing very well. Dumping love. Jeez. You did scare me. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. I do fear dogs. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> Cockroaches, scarecrows, and dogs. Mm. <laughs> Some combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> Uh, well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. Oh, okay. I guess it's like, uh, we finished an episode. I've already seen all this, I just wasn't sure if we can avoid What's it. What's going on? Not... Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. No! Shut First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Oh, son of a bitch. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh, yeah? It feels the same to me. Josh, Hannah, and Beth's brother. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I... I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey, guys. Get up here okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it is so good to see you. What's up with him? Yo, yo, yo. We got things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Yeah, gossiping. 
So Matt and Emily are a thing now, right? Yeah, so it seems. I mean, what's Mike think of that? I have a feeling Mike's already got his hands full, you know what I mean? Huh. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's got to be, like, a window around the corner we can get, like, get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. So, how are you doing? Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. All right, so I'm going to stop here. I feel like this is a good place to stop. Um, we'll continue on with trying to open this, getting into this house. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Outer Orange with some Intel Dawn. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Like, subscribe, comment, and forget to make a girl happy. Peace out.